hello, hello. And welcome back, Chris and my dark side detective. Uh, last time we just finished uh, Lochmas. And so today we're going to do Dawn of the Dead. Let's see how far we can get. I'm jumping straight in. Hope everybody's doing well and everything's going okay. Uh, the chief summoned us all to the debriefing room about a code red citywide issue. Start investigation. Dawn of the Dead. Is everyone here? Good. There are riots all over the city, so it's all hands on deck. That means you too, McLame. Time to do some real police work. Are you sure your iffy stomach is able for it? You too, stop it. Officer Murakami had, was wounded in the field, but he's been cleared by medical to give us a briefing on what's happening out there. Thanks, Chief. Guys, I've not uh, seen anything like it before. Hordes of angry citizens shambling around, attacking one another, and smashing up the place. It all seems so mindless. We don't know what's causing this behavior, but we need to get out there and stop it. Be careful out there and good luck. Squad dismissed. New detective. My first day on the job and we get to tackle a riot. How exciting. Ten bucks the newbie doesn't make it through the day. Hey, I'll take that bet, McKing. You'll do fine, detective. Actually, what's your name? Fish. <laughs> fresh fish. Mmm, fresh meat. Sorry about that. Evie not one of my things over. Sorry, McQueen. I know this isn't your usual kind of case, but I need everybody out on the streets for this. No problem, Chief. Happy to help. How's your arm? I'll live thanks to Perp. I'll live thanks. Perp tried to bite me, but I got away. Crazy, right? I love a good riot. Nothing makes me happier than to get to, uh, to get some baton swinging practice in. Dick Brickman here, reporting live from City Hall, where I, Dick Brickman, am slowly being approached by a hungry-looking politician. Mr. Politician, all reports suggest that the city is in a state of panic. Can I get a response? Grrr. Same old party line. When will these politicians liven up their acts? Old moldy clothes are in while looking alive is out. According to this, the entire city is in a state of panic. Arrest, hospitalizations, collateral damage, and purchase of spooky soundtracks are all up. My name is next to the museum, a shop downtown, and the old mafia mansion. Looks like it's going to be a busy day. I better get Dooley and hit the road. I don't know what that was. Um... Cool, let's go to Chinatown first. This is where you got McNugget's retirement urn. What a fun party. We spent the entire time chasing around monsters. Chasing memories, you mean? There is a stringless tennis racket in here. Broken racket. Oops. There's nothing uh, else in here but takeout containers and dirty magazines. Deep clean. No, I, I don't need to see it again. Back alley mystic shops are never run by a McGillicuddy or Sanchez, are they? I can't make out anything inside, but these flyers advertise some local businesses. The grain distribution company, Hall & Oats. Ha! <laughs> Hall & Oats. Uh, the sanctuary for sensory, uh, sensory deprived animals, deaf leopards. And the shop I buy my coats in, Fleece Wool Max. Okay, that, those are some nice references there. Um, let's see. Are those paws? Nah, they couldn't be. Help, I'm trapped. Get rid of them. Various books on positive living. Feng Shui and harnessing the energy of the secret hell beast to control your enemies. Wait, what? Crystals used for some form of healing, I guess. Ow, this is sharp. Hmm, that might be useful. Healing crystals. Skull. Is that a skull real? 
That's the skull of the previous shop owner. Her will stipulated I keep it on display at all times. Where is this lady that's talking anyway? <clears throat> a dream catcher used for trapping nightmares. May be useful in this nightmare. Dream catcher. Given my current predicament, I'm starting to think none of these lucky charms work. Nice lanterns. A shop like this runs on ambience. 80% of all sales are because customers can't see what they're buying. That's pretty. You should buy it. Treat yourself. Now's not the time to be shopping. Carpet diem. That's what I say. That's not... Never mind. I'm not coming out until those things are gone. Do you take card? Yes, I have a machine out back for skimming them. Just tell me your pin number. Well, that all sounds perfectly legitimate to me. A large trunk with a sturdy lock. It's empty inside. What's this? Chinese puzzle box. I can't figure out how to open it. No idea what's inside. What the hell? Monkey paws all came to life. Not feeling so lucky now. I hope the riots citywide aren't all undead related. Less worry, more scurry. Get rid of them. Can I use the bucket racket on them? I think I need a way to catch them, not bash them. Well, you didn't specify. Hi, Dooley. Boy, oh boy, the stuff these people believe in, eh? I can use the sharp edges to cut the dream catcher up. Okay, then put the string on the racket. It's a bit loose uh, for a game of squash, don't you think? No, but I got a net. One careful swipe and... Okay, I've caught them all. Monkey paws. Right, so... Oops. The living monkey paws. They're squirming to get free. I need to find somewhere to secure... The, yeah. Here. That's this area. <laughs> Locked down. Thank goodness you came, officers. I don't know how else I'd ha have escaped. You guys... They couldn't send some other cops. The whole force is busy. This is harassment. You called us. Hello again. Wang, who's Wang? My name is uh, Detective McQueen. Hmm, looks like we've got the wrong guy. What happened here? My lucky rabbit's foot, the monkey paws, the body out back, they all started moving. Body out back? I never said that. You've got no proof. Dooley, you hear him? Hmm, what's happening? I tuned out. You are asking so many questions. Sigh. All this started not long after my store was robbed last night. We found those gremlins in the end. Not in my shop, you didn't. You sold them to Dooley. I couldn't have sold him something that doesn't exist. Wink. You just said wink to me. No, I didn't. Wink. Tell me more about the robbery. Last night, some goons floated in. They smashed the place up and took some entirely legal ritual components. Ritual components doesn't sound legal. Good thing for me that the evidence was stolen then. Floated in? Yep, floated in a green haze. That sounds like Darksiders to me. I don't think we'll find anything else here, Dooley. I'm not sure what the Darksiders are doing here, but we need to get to the next crime scene. Yay. Um... Museum or mansion? Let's go mansion. We have reports of a break-in at the Dawn's old mansion. Let's check it out. Detective, the city is in chaos. Surely we've better things to focus on than a derelict building. We don't know who they are or why they broke in. This mansion belonged to a mafia Dawn. For all we know, there is a hidden weapon cache in here. Given how crazy things are across the city today, whatever they want, we had better make sure they don't get it. Was that a good use of police resources and time? No. Was it fun? Yes. Oh, he built the sandcastles. These things remind me of some of the people we've met on our cases. It says, stay out. Luckily, the law doesn't apply to us. Duly, the law does apply to us. Just not in this particular case. So what kind of stuff did this Don do? You name it, he did it. Racketeering, money laundering, bootlegging, and more. And more, as if making tennis rackets, washing money, and forcing people to wear boots wasn't bad enough. Oh, Dooley. You said a Don owned this place, like a mafia Don. Yep. Yeah. 
one of the most feared men in the country, Al Compone. He terrorized people for all sorts of things, but we could never prove any of it. Any resemblance to persons living or dead are purely coincidental. What got him in the end? Tax evasion. He swerved to avoid a truck on thumbtacks, and we got him on dangerous driving charges. He died in prison, and this place has been condemned ever since. Tax evasion. I thought that was funny. Uh, window. These boarded windows make it hard to see much inside. A condemned sign. I don't see why it's condemned. Looks like a perfectly fine sign to me. This must belong to whoever is in there. This stuff looks dangerous. I'd better power it down for now. You received item battery. Cool. He's bored. Yeah. Same thing. Sir, you can't be here. This place is condemned. Brains. That's not right. Is there somebody there? Yes, are you okay? It'd be a lot better if I wasn't trapped in here by that thing. Rag. Hold on, we'll do something. Don Capone. It's one, that's one mean looking mobster. He was also mean acting. Do you think those two facts are related? This seems to be the rope that holds the chandelier in place. Seems to be stuck. What a potentially convenient located table. You know, this place isn't so bad. A lick of paint, some new furniture, get rid of the maniac butler, and it could be a nice HQ for urban uh, blood wolfing. A surprisingly tame couch for a mob boss to have in his house. Snarl. Snap. Zombie noises. We need to audition better extras. It seems to be the rope that holds the chandelier in place. Seems to be stuck. Now that's a large chandelier. Geez, if that dropped on somebody, it'd really hurt. Yeah, probably. Outside. Let's go in here and see if we can find something. I can't open this one. I wonder what treasures are inside. Not enough to force it open, however. Various supplies, including candles. I think I'll take one. Yay! Sink. That liquid is so dark and stinky, I wouldn't put my hand in there for any reward. No knives, scissors, or other sharp objects. What a convenient inconvenience. There are the remains of a long-forgotten roast chicken in here. It is not edible, Dooley. Sigh. We could use these at the Blood Wolf camp. Somebody ruined our pots by melting marshmallows all over them. Hmm. I don't know who did that. Er, what? Somebody, what a, those monsters. Somebody half cleaned this cup. I'm sure they won't mind me taking their sponge. Still wool. Oops. Yes, I didn't mean to click on those again. Cough, what a stink. Somebody forgot to clean out the fridge when this place was condemned. Anything in there I can eat? Dooley, it's all rotten. But I'm so hungry, you made things sound urgent, so I skipped second breakfast. This is urgent, Dooley. Fine, but after this, you're buying me pancakes. Is he a hobbit? Well. I guess. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just leave this here. Doesn't look like it's working. Um, sorry. Blood Wolf trick. Combine a battery with steel wool to make a fire starter. Little Emily taught me that. Yeah, I bet. That's plausible. Yeah. This should be able to burn through the rope in a suitably slow and dramatic fashion. Uh oh. Burn the whole house down. It's uh, safe to come out now. Detective, is now a good time to mention I'm allergic to fire? Oh, we set the painting on fire. Raxa? You guys, I owe you big time. What were you doing in, he in here? Actually, for no reason, no reason at all. We should go outside before you tell us. Oh my god. Did we leave a light on in there? Um, yeah. Thanks for saving me back there. 
Are you okay? I am, thanks to you guys. What's up with the get up? I'm in an inspector now. I'm an inspector now. Since I kept feeding, f feeding, I kept finding myself in weird goings on, I licensed myself to franchise. And there is a localized storm in here last night, so I knew that meant something was happening after the events at the library. Good catch. Is this your equipment? It is. It's a spooktometer. Do you like it? It reads for spooktivity. I brought it with me to help get readings. But I got trapped in that room and didn't get to look at the readings yet. Trapped by that creature? Later, yes, but not at first. There were people here, searching the place. Their accents were hard to understand, but they were looking for the dawn. But he's been dead for a while. Yeah, they left when they realized that. I waited a while to make sure they didn't come back. But then that thing bursts out of the floor and I was trapped again. So what did the readings say? That's odd, the battery's missing. Whistles innocently. Thankfully, there's a printout inside it. Give me a second while I open it up. Wow, lots of spectral readings. Whoever, whatever, was looking for the Dawn, they weren't human. So Darksiders want something from Dawn's house? What could it be? Okay, let's keep investigating, Dooley. You should go too. Yep, before the fire spreads. Fire? No, that's, um, the sun's reflection. It's nighttime. Bye. <laughs> we, we totally didn't set that house on fire. Why is the door smashed in? Looks like a break-in. Looters? Maybe, but they tend to go for televisions, not tapestries. Let's check it out. Seems there's an Egyptian-themed display at the moment. Woo-wee, those Egyptians were big. Those pictures aren't to scale. I knew that. I don't like museums. They're just graveyards for old stuff. I think our car is old enough to be on the uh, exhi exhibition. Yeah, no joke. Put it on the exhibit. I think that's everything. Go inside. An impressive specimen. There seems to be something stuck in here, but it's too far for me to reach it. After watching extensive historical footage, Twin Lakes researchers believe this beast escaped a Costa Rican theme park in the early 90s. Presumed cause of death is drowning as its tiny arms wouldn't have been great for swimming to the mainland. While the team here must be top of their field. Yeah. He's safe though. This is what a plastic skeleton looks like. Scientists think it may be what the human body was modeled on. Fascinating. I like how, do, how McQueen's like, hmm. An ape, probably. What a fine institute of learning this is. It's locked. I wonder if I can open it somehow. This will keep going. Ooh, there are undead here too? What's causing all of this? Rrrr. Looks like some jewelry is missing. The plaque says, The Gem of Osiris. The Egyptian Death God. I can't help but think that's tied in with what's going on across the city. A scepter. Accept her? I don't even know her. Wait, who are we talking about? Yay. This must be where that mummy came from. Moan. It sounds like the uh, Minecraft zombie moan. I don't know why, how or why. But that thing must have come out of that sarcophagus. I better look for a way to lure it back in there. You'd have to be a pretty you'd have to be pretty sick to try swallowing that medicine. <laughs> Stone tablet, no. Uh yeah. Can we use this to get whatever it is? I wonder if I can use this to dislodge whatever he ate. Oh, that must have been Tony Rex's last meal. Tony, the tea has to stand for something. Bird bones. All right. Let's see if we can lock pit this with these. Everything likes to use bird bones to lock pit. Uh, these might work as a makeshift lock picking kit, a very fragile kit. Maybe if I match these bones to the tumblers in the lock, I'll be able to open the cabinet. Uh, 
Uh, so. That seems to be it. Now to see what's inside. A jar of pickled brains. I prefer pickled onions myself. Ew. Well, if you're a zombie... Sorry, pickled brain, but I need to take care of some undead business. Yum. There's a case closed pun in here somewhere, but there's just no time. Dooley, I just figured it out. The Darksiders weren't looking for something at Dawn's house. They were looking for the Dawn. And she said he was dead, which is why they took the Gem of Osiris and the ritual components. They're trying to resurrect him. Wow, Detective, what an amazing coincidence that every place the Chief Senus was tied in so tightly with what's really going on. If we had been sent to even one different location, you may never have pieced it all together. There's no time to work out the undoubtedly small probability of things having worked out like this. We need to get to the graveyard, and fast. We can't let him return. Uh, graveyard. <laughs> I like this game. Telescope. I wonder if we can get an overview of the situation from here. That's what I feared. The place is swarming with zombies. These must be the dark siders we've heard about. They're firing at somebody inside the church. I can't make out who, though. Look, Dooley, over there. There's some bad mumbo jumbo happening at the crypt. We need to stop them from bringing the dawn back. This is Detective McQueen. We have tracked the source of all this to the graveyard, requesting backup. Sisters are scattered across the city. There's nobody there to help. You're on your own, Detect. Drat. Looks like it's just you and me, Dooley. McQueen and Dooley solving crimes while looking coolie. Wow, Dooley. You made me sing that. That's not cool. Okay, back to the graveyard? Stars? See that constellation, Detective? That's called stars. That's that's helpful. Thank you. Well, okay. Urgar, rar. No doubt about it. There's zombies, all right. Looks like we're not getting in that way. I hope that gate holds. They're far too eager a welcoming party. Maybe leaving the lights on wasn't the best way to sneak up on this place. Might need this nightstick to keep the welcoming party at bay. Yay. Hey, bros, I need help. I'm being confronted with dangers to both my physical self and my dogmatic views on the universe here. There's somebody trapped in the church. If we don't get in and help them, they'll be zombie fodder. All right. Get back, you monsters. Finally, a positive application for force brutality. Police brutality. Rargh. Well, its hand broke off, but it doesn't seem to care. We might need another way in. Ew, we got a zombie arm. I hope that gate holds are far too- yeah. Ew, a helping hand and forearm. Ew. Oh, maybe we can climb over this way. An oil can. I could use that oil to- I could use that to oil the wheels, but I can't quite reach it. Well, okay, in position. Now to squeeze this muscle and got it. Ew. Guys, it appears to be a box of stew. Is it warm? Could, no, Dooley, you could not eat the old box stew. A bag full of magic eight balls. What do they say? Ask again later. Ah, but I want to know. <laughs> That's Dooley. What a load of rubbish. Oh, look, I need one of those for my house. Dude, stop dumpster diving. Nothing seems to be happening. Yeah. Well, I was trying to... Okay, that's the wheels oiled up. Let's push this into position, Dooley. Okay, Dooley. I'll go over the wall. You go through the sewers. Hopefully that way one of us can save those people and stop the dawn from being brought back. Have I mentioned that I don't like ton... Not the time, buddy. The city needs us. I know. Hey, detective? Yeah. Be careful. You too, buddy. You too. Oh, I'm Dooley. That's 
I don't think we've been to him yet. That way is blocked off by a large gate. What secrets are you hiding, gate? When all this is done, I'm going to launch an investigation into you. I'll call it Gate Gate. No doubt this is a secret bolt hole for government informants. This is how the government pumps uh, dehydrogen de monoxide into our homes. Monsters. Oh, all right. A TV show on urban legends. What nonsense. Hey, little guy. What are you doing down here? Snarl. I'm watching my stories. Leave me be. A gator. In the sewers. Watching TV? Well, that story checks out to me. Enjoy, mister. Just keep an eye out for cannibals. Alright. This box holds all the power in the city. Electrical and political. Smart. Uh, hi, Dooley. Uh, aren't you gonna say hello? One second there, guy. What's a clown doing down here? This isn't a circus. Uh, I give balloons to wayward kitties. Do you now? And, uh, there's cotton candy and rides and all sorts of, um, surprises down here. Surprises? Did I mention the balloons come in all colors? Hmm, I see no harm in any of this. Good on you for making sure those lost kids aren't frightened. Um... Thanks, as you were. You too? That boat's not the only thing uh, floating down here. Oh, all right. I don't trust you, Thumb. Gents, interesting sign you have here. Um, thanks. What, uh, what are you working on? Us? We're repairing the power lines. You've noticed all those flickering lights across the city recently? We're going to fix that. That sure is great. A great excuse. Do you think I'm an idiot? Eh? I see your sign. That's an inverted eye. You guys are eye masons. Refrigerate. Wait, what? What? Yeah. No, the other one. Freeze. I meant freeze. This is why so many of my TV dinners spoil. Drop your stuff and get out of here. I'd arrest you, but I've places to be. What are you talking about? We're just here to fix... Resisting arrest, is it? I guess we had to listen to officer and take the rest of the day off, Tyrese. Sure. It'll be nice to get home to family early for a change. Wow, Dooley. I'll confiscate this so they can't return to whatever shady business they were at. Okay. Devilish debris from a cunning foe. Okay, that's all the same. I wonder what nasty business they were up to. Digging a hole to the planet hidden inside our planet? Or building a lair for the lizard people who secretly rule over us? Maybe they were planning to sacrifice something to the mole men. Whatever it was, it's been thwarted. Alright. This gate is blocking me from going any further. If only there was a way past it. Can I use this? When life gives you lemons, smash those lemons with a hammer. Then send the lemon carcasses back to life so that it, know, so that it knows not to mess with you again. <laughs> Meanwhile. Painted himself into a corner. Nobody heard what happened to him. Eaten alive by bugs. Drowned in a stack overflow. Crushed by writer's block. Are these the... Look here, Slim. We got you in it. We got us a stray zombie. Huh, <laughs> yeah, stray. Fire a few rounds to chase it off and be thankful that we ain't got the hordes to deal with. Hey, <laughs> yeah, horde. Dude. All right. We've been breached. Charge. Ah, wait. Crikey, I do apologize. I thought you were the hun come to munch on my brain for military secrets. But I can tell you're a Yankee boy. It's in the stance. Not rigid enough. Shoulders like a melted ice cream on a sunny Sunday morning. Eh. Uh, this seems obscure enough to be useful. Hands off, old boy. Those huns outside smell dreadful. That mask is my only protection. Can I help you, old bean? 
Who are you? Brigadier Ren Reginald Smith. Smithy to my friends. Of course, I have no friends. No time for friends in the army, eh? Surely you're not still in the army. My dear chat, when you sign up, you sign up for life. How long have you been here? Blimey, I don't jolly well know. Crashed here as a young man, took a job as a grave digger as I wasn't a citizen. All happened some time ago, I should imagine. Are you okay? You look like you've been through a lot. This? This is just a scratch. You should have seen the Hun when we were done with them. Your military man, can you help gear me up for a fight? Hanging with a war effort, or helping with a war effort? Sounds spiffy. I still have my military kit. Let's see. There's my mess tin, but things seem messy enough here already. A water bottle, but that's been shot up. A ground sheet. Hmm, a sheet would probably be more use if it wasn't, uh, hasn't been ground up. It's not looking good, old chap. I tell you what, take my gas mask. It's over there on the shelf. Thanks. Anything to stop Fritz from in his traps. Toodle pip. Gas mask. Now be careful with that. Probably still has some mustard gas caked on into it. Where was this when I was hunting down those gremlins? Yeah, right? <laughs> huh, boots in my size. Like them, old chap? They're yours. Belong to a sergeant of mine in the war. Um, thanks. Wait a second. These aren't normal boots. They've got metal sockets in them. He had mechanical legs. Needed special shoes that would click on. That's why I have no use for him. Hmm, how generous. That's a nice helmet. It's poor form to comment on another man's piece, old chap. I'm afraid you can't have that, old chap. I need it to bash zombie Fritz should he try to enter my bunker. So nice and warm, another reason not to want to go back out there. Built it myself from plane parts after I was shot down during the Great War. I say Great War, but really it was mediocre at best. Alright. Can I... Oh no, this is the same thing. Okay. I hope the structure is sturdy because a piece of this could prove handy. Ooh, thank you. Um, will those go in the boots? The scaffolding is a perfect fit. Stilts. Ooh, I made stilts. Can I? I don't know. I don't think I need stilts just yet. Oh, brains. I can't pass by them. But maybe I can if I find a way to go over them and get in through that broken window. Rawr! Wow, I need to get out of here before I get munched on. Well, okay, that works. Okay, let's try these out. They can't get me all the way up here. Aw, brains. Okay, through the window. The dark side goons shoot shot out the window, giving me a handy way in. Nice. Ancient McScream, what are you doing here? What are any of us doing anywhere? Helpful as all ever. I need to save whoever is trapped in the bell tower, then figure out a plan to get to the crypt and stop that ritual. What are you doing here? I circle the wounded, barking at the beast that would feast on carrion. Hmm, that's still not helpful. I'm going to presume you mean I'm here because of the other Darksiders are here. Presumption is the mother of the dragons. All right. Uh. Sensor is full of old caked and moldy smelling incense. Lovely. Those candles are bigger than my head. Hey there, any chance of a miracle? No? Right. Ugh. What's going on here? What are you doing in Brightside? Ugh, my innards. Are you okay? Been shot, son, right in the gut. So it was you and McScream those goons were shooting at. That it were, son. Burning up in the inside out, I am. Dark side bullets is not like yours, what with them being full of cursed components, as it were. What can I do to help? Can we remove the bullet? Cannot be removed normally, son. I need some purified water to wash the badness out. I'll take a look around. As you were then, son. Oh, okay. Let's go to the bell tower. 
Get back, demon bro. Great, now I'm soaked. Gnarly, thought you were a hollow, hollow head, hollow head, blah. Total wipeout on my end, bro. Right, do you have a towel I can borrow? An assortment of extreme sporting goods from scuba tanks to hang gliders and oddly face paints. Why do you have all this? Dude, I like to extreme to the max and you can't extreme to the max without painting your face. But the scuba tank is bust. I lost the mouthpiece. I'm gonna throw it out. Hmm, mind if I take it? Sure, dude. Enjoy. Tank. Shiny bell. Thanks, I polished it myself. Sorry for the washout, dude. All the heads don't like holy water, my friend amigo. Turns them into mush burgers. Good to know. Can I have some holy water? Far out, dude. Happy to share the Lord's liquid. Don't say it like that. I'm way low right now. Wasted my last wipeout on you, but you can have my dregs. But dude, it's not enough to mush a hollow. Holy water. Thank you. I came to save you. Are you okay? Given the circumstances, I'm happy to be topside and not drowning in a swell of undead. We need to get you out of here. If you can cause a break in the wave of undead, I can get myself out, dude. Hmm. How will I do that? Like the surfer listens to the sea, maybe you should listen to the dead? That actually might work. Good idea. The Lord speaks through me, Brosef. Uh, which is all the sports gear. I was meant to go, I was meant to be going on an extreme sports holiday, but I stayed to bless some babies. Bro, I will not make that mistake again. Cool. Sayonara, dude. Let's go back down here. Use this to wash out your wound. Much better, thank you. Thank you for that. Feel better now? Much better. Ready for the fight the forces of evil once more. I knew I was right about you. Good egg, this one. All right. Good day, son. And Godspeed. Cool. It has core religious text from all major faiths and a note saying just in case. A blocky dog's calendar. Pens, letter opener, some reading glasses with the lenses popped out. I'll take the letter opener. I wish I had a nice chair like this back in the office. I couldn't confiscate this for the case, could I? No. Could I, though? No. It's a heavy-duty shredder. It could probably even tear up clothes. Alright. That might be handy. My makeshift entrance. I can still hear the zombies outside. Brains, brains, brains. Brains? Brains. Sounds like they're arguing. If only I could understand them. Well, yeah. I spoke with Ghoulie. Does he still fester in the pits of agony? He's recovering now. Only if you consider getting better to be recovering. Right. Do you think he can teach me to talk to zombies? Are we not all, in a way, zombies? Listen closely. Some time later. Huh, that was easier than I thought. Everything is easy for the ignorant. Hey! Okay, let's find out what those zombies are saying. Okay, let's try this again. Brains, brains, brains. Brains? Brains. They seem angry and confused. If I could dis disguise myself as one of them, I think I could unionize them and lead them away from the church. I need to find a way to make myself look and smell less alive. Uh, okay. If that's the case. Sorry, Cope, but I need to look more undead-ish. Yeah, there we go. That had moldy... St yeah. If I can find a way to scrape some of it loose, I could use it to mask my lovely, yeah. If I can scrape enough uh, to rub on my coat, I should smell less alive. And done. Boy, that stinks. Ew, he's all covered in that now. That's gross. Um, This guy had, like, face paints and stuff. Right? Can I use your face paints to make me look undead? I can do that 110%, bro. Percents only go up to 100. 
ten, one ten, bro. One ten. Fine. Okay, I'm green. Sign hard, dude. Okay, so. Can I leave now? Okay, I should be able to pass as one of them now. Brains. Uh. Brains? Brains. Brains. Brains, brains. Brains? Brains, brains, brains. Brains! Okay, they've agreed to unionize under my leadership. Time to go talk to the people who brought them back. There's a flower bed. What a ni nice smelling flower. Her? Ahem. Brains? Uh, okay, so we can only go this way. Okay, we're at the water tower. Eating alive bugs. I didn't mean to click on that. Mama Mia, it's a zombie horde. Run, Slim. Hit. <laughs> yeah, run. They stole a good solid car. We'll be tied anything that ha this crashed into. Car key. Those goons must have dropped these before running off. Okay, cool. So we've got some car keys now. The keys to the car, the dark side, Mafiso stole. Can we go in the crash? Stop right there. Too late, Bright Sider. Rar, I live. He is no zombie. He's a human, you fools. Brains? Oh no. Destroy him. Brains. So this is how it ends. Not with a bang, but with me whimpering. I think this is about to give. Yeah, go Dooley. Dooley! He's trapped under the rubble with all those zombies. I need to save him. The priest said that holy water turned them to mush, but where would I find enough of it? This must be the ritual paint taken from Wang's. They used it to paint those markings and summon the corpse one soul into their Dawn's bar. Okay, got the paint. Statue of Saint Monica, patron saint of being trapped in spooky crypts with bad guys. This must be the markings for the ritual to summon Dawn from the dark sides. I don't understand why a flow why a floating being needs a ladder to paint on walls, but I'm glad they do. This could make a passable walkway. Alright. Can I use this to... This should get me across. Okay. Uh, wait. Groan. He's semi-conscious. Why aren't they trying to eat him? Brains! Uh... The mask should hold up as a replacement for breathing apparatus for a few minutes at least. Okay, if we're going to need holy water to wash them out, maybe he needs this. Quickly put this on, buddy. Okay. Hope for the best. Alright, let's go back this way. I go. Uh, talk to the priest. I need you to bless the water tower for me. Bro, are you for real, bro? I've gotten all the undead into the sewers and need to flush them fast. I've been waiting to be asked to churn out that much god juice, like, literally forever. You have a distinct way of talking about your faith. What can I say, bro? The Lord is my surf guy. We hang tight and hang often, and I want to bring the whole world out of the waves with us. But we, the Lord and I, take safety mucho serioso. Take this life ring with you in case you get caught up in the flood. A flood to wash the sinners away. Super biblical, bro. Super biblical. Life ring. Yay. Dude, bro, I'm going to go do my thing, bro. May the big G be on your side. All right. This way? I don't remember which way I go to get out. Uh, let's see. Okay, Dooley is ready. I'm ready. Are you ready up there, Father? K 
Cowabunga. I'll take that as a yes. Best of luck, dude. I'm off to my vacay. The pedal's locked in place and the car is good to go. I hope my aim is true. Push. Ah. That's some nasty looking holy water. Hey Dooley, are you okay there, buddy? Cough, cough. Feeling a little wet behind the ears, but I'm okay. Glad to hear it. Oh no. Ah, you took my minions. I'll have to create new ones, starting with your friend. Cough, cough. Hold on, Dooley. Damn it. If there, if only there was a way I could send it on back to the dark side. Uh, this? I need to copy the ritual markings onto this ring to turn it into a makeshift portal. Uh, okay. So, this one here? Where is it? Here? that work? My improvised portal is ready for use. I just need to take careful aim. No! Yes. Got him. Enjoy your exile back to the dark side. You okay, Dooley? Cough. I'll live, detective. Good, I was worried about you there for a minute, buddy. Let's get you out of those sewers. Now then, now then, now then, now then. We has arrested the rest of his accomplices and locked them away. This uncooperated to reduce his sentence, reverse the ritual side effect that raised the dead in your city. Should be that all the undead is back to being plain old dead now. Good, because I had no idea what I was going to, how I was going to fix that. That was crazy dangerous magic, guy. I was young and innocent, easily misled. It happened a half an hour ago. I've grown a lot in that time. A new man, ready for parole, I'd say. Anyway, we owe you for this, Brightsiders. You're welcome. I'd say any time, but let's make sure this never happens again, eh? Absolutely. Let's get to processing this lot, eh, Agent? Sometime later. Dick Brickman here with Detective Mick King, who just received a medal for stopping the riots across the city. Can you tell me, Dick Brickman, and the them, the viewers of Dick Brickman, what happened, Detective? There were riots across the city, and uh, now there aren't. Light on the details there, Detective. Your wife is the mayor. Is that a conflict of interest? Nope. There you have it, friends. No conflicts and one fancy medal. Congratulations to the Detective. After all that, I can't believe he got a medal instead of you, Detective. They're saying that the water tower burst a few days prior and got tainted by dead bodies before leaking into the reservoir, giving everyone temporary madness. At least we know what happened. You're a hero, Detective. Thanks, buddy. That means a lot. Case closed. Yay! <laughs> We've done the six, six cases. That is awesome. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with some Dark Side Detective. This game is absolutely amazing. It, it really is a lot of fun. I like this. If you're into point and click and you like the sense of humor, it's, it's a good one to give a go. Uh, as always, if you like this video, if you wouldn't mind dropping a like and subscribe, that would be absolutely fantastic. It always makes my day and it really does help out the channel a lot. Um, I also have a Twitter and a Discord where I try and post the uh, newly published links to the videos. I'm a lot better about it on the Discord than I am the Twitter, but it would be great to have you guys come hang out. And um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and call it there. Thank you guys so much. Have a great day. Take care and I will catch you next time.
bye